In this video, I'm going to demonstrate our LoRa mesh network with four sensor nodes and one LoRa receiver, which is connected to a laptop. The laptop will visualize the network topology. Now I'm starting the four sensor nodes by plugging into the batteries. On the laptop, we will see how the network topology is gradually built up. Each of the sensor nodes periodically sends out its routing information to a LoRa receiver, and the LoRa receiver sends the routing information to the laptop through serial port. The red, yellow, blue, and green nodes represent the four sensor nodes, and the lines between each two nodes indicate the link between them two. The numbers on the lines are the single strengths in DBN. The larger the number is, the shorter the length will be. Now we will show how the network automatically adapts to the change of the single strength from the sensor nodes. We connect the antenna to node 4, which is green on the laptop screen. The antenna will amplify the signal from node 4. On the laptop, we can see links connected with node 4 are gradually shrinking, and eventually node 4 moves to the center in the network topology because it has stronger signal than the other nodes. It is also possible in the network that some nodes fail. Then, the failure loads should be identified and removed from the network. To say this, we try to unplug the battery from node 4, then the receiver would not receive routing information from node 4 anymore. After a certain timeout, the links from node 4 will disappear. Node 1, 2, 3 also do not hear from node 4 for a while. After a timeout, they all think node 4 are dead, so their links to node 4 are gradually removed. Eventually, Node 4 is identified and isolated from the network. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoy it.